helping you? Well, kind of, with a new program to help Americans pay back taxes. CPA Alan Sanderson is here with us this morning. And Alan, last week the IRS announced a major overhaul of its Fresh Start program. So first and foremost, well, thanks for being with us. Thank you. Hope you enjoyed the holiday. It was great. Great. What are the changes and uh, explain why this took place? This is really a huge opportunity for taxpayers to get back on their feet. The old program that allowed you to settle a delinquent tax debt, the formulas that were being used by the IRS were just totally unreasonable and even in good times, you, they set the taxpayer up for failure. There was no way you could actually repay the debt. Well, what happened was people gave up. They'd go back into the underground economy, they just quit paying, they became non-filers. Next thing you know, the number of people uh, piles up that owe money to the Treasury and you're not getting anywhere with your system. In bad times, obviously, it gets worse. So they needed to do something about the system and that's why the big changes. And you're going to talk about the change in the calculation that people owe. Yes. Uh, when we see you in 10 minutes, you're going to define that for us. All right, good information. Thank Thanks, you. Alan. You we bet. appreciate it. There is hope for taxpayers struggling to pay Uncle Sam, and it is coming from the IRS. Alan Sanderson, CPA, here to tell us about the Fresh Start program. And Alan, you mentioned during the last time we spoke 10 minutes ago, a revision to the calculation of a taxpayer's future income. Talk about this calculation and how it can help people. This is really huge, Natalie. What has happened here is that, let's say you owe the IRS $45,000 or something. They had a calculation that's a very tough one that says, okay, we think you can pay back or afford to pay back $10,000 a year, and if so over four years, we'll settle it for $40,000. You need a $5,000 benefit there. Most taxpayers weren't able to make that. Under this program, you could take that same calculation and make it only one year. So now they say, I'll settle my debt with $10,000 instead of $40,000. So now you see a huge difference. That's a $30,000 swing and you have a $35,000 debt forgiveness effectively to the IRS. Really a good deal. And the beauty of it is it allows you to actually have a fighting chance of making it, getting out of debt with the IRS, and then getting back on your feet and headed into the direction that you need to be headed financially. And the great, great information, Alan. And as we continue on this topic, mm -hmm. that fresh start program that you're defining for us, mm -hmm. we're going to talk about uh, the allowable living expense category, what that's all about. When we come back, thank you. You may still be paying Uncle Sam for this past, past April's tax return. And just last week, the IRS announced a major overhaul, which allows you to settle a big tax debt for pennies on the dollar. CPA Alan Sanderson is talking about the Fresh Start program this morning. Good to see you again, Alan. Thank you. Now, part of that program is a calculation of what you can afford to pay when your right. living expenses are subtracted. How does that work? It's kind of interesting. The old program was a difficult calculation. Let's look at our other deal. You have 45000 and you figured out how to pay $10,000 instead of $40,000 to settle that debt. Well, what happens if you turn that into $5,000? And that's what happens. Under the old system, you had a deal where they did not take into consideration credit card debt, bank loans, bank fees, all the other good stuff. They said, oh, you could afford to pay $900 a month, but in fact, you could only pay $500 a month and make it. Under this other system, now, you could take those other debts out of the picture, have a realistic calculation, and actually make it. So, that same $45,000 debt that you thought you could get rid of for $10,000, you can get rid of now for $5,000 in a very simple calculation. Why is this good? Well, it keeps people from going into default on the credit cards or the bank loans, so you don't have banks failing. The FDIC that has no money doesn't have to pay those things off. Everybody wins under this new system. All right, thanks, Alan. And you're going to talk to us about repaying student loans and then state and local delinquent taxes the next time we see you in it. about 10 minutes. Thank you. All morning, we've been talking about changes to the IRS's Fresh Start program that were instituted just last week. And CPA Alan Sanderson is here to explain what those changes mean to you. And Alan, one of those changes is going to help taxpayers pay back student loans and delinquent taxes. This is probably one of the most huge opportunities here in the entire uh, Fresh Start system. Under the old system, you couldn't really get benefit from the student loans that you owed or the delinquent property taxes on your house that you had to pay back to stay in your house or to keep your house from going back to the bank. So what happened was you were put in a position where you were guaranteed to fail based on their calculations. Now, those student loans that you had to pay off are fractured into the calculation of how much you can pay to the IRS and also the delinquent taxes on your house. Now you have a chance to get those student loans paid 
to get that house paid to stay in your house. Again, what's the benefit? Well, people in homes continue to pay mortgages. The loan losses aren't out there. The property taxes are getting paid into the municipalities. So the folks that are out there who really want to succeed, who want to get back into this system, who may have taken it on the chin because a business failed in a bad economy or whatever the case may be, those people get a chance now to factor that into the calculation again. That $10,000 that they said you could maybe owe instead of the $40,000 turns into $5,000. And you keep your home, you keep paying your student loan, and everybody works out well. People who are deadbeats aren't going to pay into the system anyway. Folks who really want to make it, really want to get back on their feet, get back into the system, they're the ones that benefit from this. And that works out well for all of us in the long run. All right. Thanks, Alan. Have a great day.